Hold up. What's going on guys, Mr. Clasher here, welcome back to another Clasher Clans video and today I'm bringing you guys as I promised my 10,000 subscribers Q&A Now, I promised it was going to be yesterday and a little bit sooner but I was posting Clan Wars recaps and everything so nonetheless it is here and real quick, if you guys have 1080p quality on your phone or PC this is my first time actually recording in 1080p my first ever Clasher Clans video so hopefully the quality the quality is a bit sharper, but let's go. Let's go on with the questions. So I'm gonna be reading the questions from the first asked to the top to the most recent one. So let's get started. This is from Kui Clash of Clans Bird Minecraft. W will you do other games such as Minecraft, COD, and all of that on my Clash channel? No, but I have done Call of Duty and other games on my first channel, and obviously I quit that channel to start. A Clash of Clans channel, and I don't really plan on to do um, COD or Minecraft, but I maybe do Rival Kingdoms, maybe some Boom Beach later on. But I will be sticking to mostly Clash of Clans videos. So thank you for the question. I am Pro15 asks Clasher. I have a question. Who is your favorite member in Proud Gamers, Proud Elite, and Proud YouTubers? Only one, and it can be it can be Ray or anyone you know in person. Wow, that's actually a tough question. Um, in Proud Gamers, there's a lot of cool people such as Ace and a couple others. Now, I don't know about my favorite clan members as both of, all three of my family clans are pretty awesome. Proud Elite, I gotta say I am pro. He's pretty cool. Um, he's actually pretty loyal. That, even though he has the question, I've, a I've actually met him before in Clash of Clans and Proud Elite before he came to our main clan. He's pretty cool. Um, Baby Cakes um, and a couple others. Proud YouTubers, probably Steven Main, um, Destroyer Oakwood, Kyle, and um, I just like everybody, every clan member. I'm not trying to like um, diss everybody, but every clan member is awesome. But you know, those are the main ones. And uh, yeah, Proud Elite. Actually, Proud Elite uh, doesn't exist anymore. Uh, so yeah. I think it's Proud YouTubers, Pacific Eagles, and Proud Gamers. Uh, Proud Elite doesn't exist anymore. Um, let's, uh, I'm going to scroll all the way up to the next question. Let's see which, which one is the next one. Um, let's see. Okay. H H Halo Yang asks, What is your favorite clan, Proud Gamers, Proud YouTubers, or Pacific Eagles? Well, obviously, since I'm the leader of Proud YouTubers, that is my favorite clan. But I do enjoy uh, Proud Pacific Eagles. They are a really good clan. They do some really good clan wars and everything. And uh, Proud Gamers are pretty cool too. So all three family clans are awesome. But Proud YouTubers are probably my favorite one since I am the leader of the clan. All right, we're gonna try to go to the next question. Um, Baby Carl said a face reveal and he got four likes. Obviously, I'm not gonna do that. Um, I'm, I have a lot of congrats on 10k. And okay, so the next question is Twitchy. He asks, "What is your motivation to keep making videos? Also, what is your favorite sport and team and coordinated to this sport?" So, what is your motivation to keep making videos? Um, my motivation is pretty awesome. Every day I wake up and I feel like making an awesome Clash of Clans video. I have a lot of ideas and everything, so I have pretty high motivation to keep making Clash of Clans videos for you guys, and I enjoy them as well. Also, what is your favorite sport and a team and court? in coordinate to the sport I like actually watching sometimes NFL football and my favorite team is the Cowboys I'm, I'm sure there's gonna be a lot of haters but Cowboys are my favorite team all right um, let's see okay so the next question is by Zachy Chan Clash King he asks what do you suggest new youtubers do to get subscribers I get this question quite a lot and I just say be original, create your own content, kind of, and have high quality Clash of Clans videos. Don't be recording with an iPod or an iPad in front of your phone like I did when I first started my Clash channel. I definitely do not recommend that. So be original, have good quality videos, and just be entertaining overall. Um, let's see. Um, okay, so the next question, I was just looking through them. 
Clash of Clans 202 asks, what weird questions have I asked in your Q&A? I just asked if your parents watch your videos. Um, what do I think of my parents watching videos? Okay, I actually erased that question. Congrats, man. My question is, what do you plan on being when you grow up? Okay, so when I grow up, I want to be somewhere working in IT, such as computer engineering or something like that. Um, this is from the same guy. Second question, do you plan on doing full-time YouTube as an adult, part-time YouTube? Um, actually, I have no clue. So far, I do YouTube just for fun. I don't think YouTube will ever be my full-time job or even part-time job um, unless I get lucky or something. I definitely don't plan um, as YouTube being my income when I get older. Um, so the next question is, okay, so he asks a lot of question, questions. Will you drop out of college to do YouTube? Um, that's actually a pretty interesting question. I have I don't know about that. I definitely don't plan on dropping from college to do YouTube, but uh, you know we'll see what's gonna happen. I definitely don't plan on dropping from college um, if I continue to do YouTube. Will you still continue to post Clash of Clans videos when you get older? Of course, guys. I plan on to do Clash of Clans videos until I you know until Clash dies or anything. I mean I'll be posting till Clash is th still there. Um, so yeah, that's all the questions he has. Clash of Clans 202. Um, the Master of Gameplay, TNT Master asks, Mr. Clasher, do you have Kick? And a lot of people ask me, dude, download Kick. Do you have Kick? Actually, I do not have Kick. Uh, really, don't plan on having Kick as texting people. Maybe later on. Okay, so the next question is by Mystic Clasher. He asks. How do you find out about COC and how long have you been playing? So the the only way I found out about playing Clash of Clans, uh, uh, I guess the game, is I was downloading. I was actually playing this jetpack game, and that keep this ads keep popping up saying Clash of Clans, you know, download for free. And I was like, you know what? I'm gonna try it out and see what happens. I tried it out, and I've been playing since then. So about over two years. Um, let's see what the next questions are. Um, I'm just going through my comments let's see somebody subs since 4,000 subscribers um just going through comments real quick all right so top 10 awesome how long have you been playing clash of clans like i said again oh, slightly over two years since i believe like yeah over two years i'm not sure the exact date but yeah i've been playing for t over two years okay hamza Warriak, I think, asks, can you start playing other games on your channel, such as Balloon Tower Defense? Honestly, I don't plan on having Balloon Tower Defense, as my channel is mainly about Clash of Clans. Um, so, I, you know, I might play other games in the future. We'll see, maybe this game or Balloon Tower Defense. But for now on, um, at least for now, I'm going to be posting Clash of Clans, and that's my main uh, kind of game on my channel. And when will you stop playing Clash of Clans? I mean, I'll stop playing till the game really can be played anymore or it's dead. And what inspired you to start a YouTube channel? Um, actually, the person that started uh, to inspire me was actually Clash of Clans Daddy. I used to watch him a lot before I started to do YouTube. And once I started to, to do YouTube, I started watching more channels. But he was the one that inspired me. Alright, th this player asks a lot of questions. Taco Boy Gaming asks, if you could add a King Queen, what troops... What troop would it be? I would say probably the Goblin King. Um, obviously, that's not going to happen. But if a Goblin King could destroy storages and everything quicker, I, I mean, I have no clue. Uh, do you think? Do you ever think you could get this far when you first started YouTube? Definitely not. When I made my 50 sub video, I never thought I would even hit 500. And look at me, I am past 10,000. Really do appreciate it. So no, I never thought I would hit the amount of subscribers I have now. What is your favorite troops in defense? My favorite defense is actually probably the either the Expo or the Inferno Tower. And the troop is probably either the Wizard or maybe the Hog Riders are. They're pretty cool troops. Um, so let's keep going on. Okay, so from Clash of Clans, Slimmy Shank, he asks, During wars, what clan castle troops give you the toughest time to deal? I think Lava Hounds, when I fully attack, Lava Hounds really do slow my attacks down. And he says minus Wizards. So yeah, my is Lava Hounds. Definitely don't like those. And the next one is, what's your favorite part of the game? Clan Wars, attack, and defending. Definitely like Clan Wars. That is the biggest part of Clash of Clans. And that's why um, I like Clash of Clans. But without Clan Wars, it's fine too. And I also do like attacking as well. David Birch asks, what is your absolute favorite troop in the game? Probably the Wizard. 
And the next question he has, what is your favorite attack strategy in the game? There's a lot of attack strategies. My, my favorite one probably will have to be Go Wipe, as I've been, since I was Town Hall 8, I Go Wiped a ton. And uh, Cortez Virgins asks, how old are you, 16? Yeah, I'm actually pretty, really close to being age of 16. What is your favorite cousin? Bear25 asks, and this is an interesting question because I have a lot of uh, a lot of cousins and a lot of my favorite cousins. So it's kind of hard to choose one w which is your favorite. I like everybody that is my cousin. So that's a hard question to ask. Um, let's see. Hector Ramirez asks, what is your favorite town hall? And I'm going to say my favorite town hall was prob probably was 8 or 9. Uh, 10 is okay, but 8 or 9 were awesome. Let's keep going down. I mean, up. Let's see what kind of uh, questions. Okay, Epic Clash Clans Raid asks, "What's your favorite attack strategy?" Probably go up, like I at, like I already said. Go up is a really good attack strategy. And then Mr. Clash of Clans Mixter says, "Who's your favorite Clash of Clans YouTuber?" Probably Galadon or uh, Daddy. They're still awesome YouTubers. Um. Do you ever do you have any plans to push this Town Hall 10 from J. Carl? Yes, I do have plans to push this Town Hall 10 later on. Will H. Tutorial ask, what do you think they should put in the next update? Maybe some new defenses or spells. Um, the games the gamers creed asks question. Hi, what age are you? I said I'm pretty much 16. Edvin Paz asks, Do you play other games in your spare time? Yes, I play some Battlefield 4 and I play some other games as well. Um, the next question is I am I am Rand Kills. I said, Mr. Clash. Or question for you, Kune. What time are you, what game are you gonna do other when COC stops? Probably Boom Beach, and other games. And then the next question is why Hog Riders are black? Well, because they're Mr. T, probably. So the next question is by at which time at which town hall and level did you start YouTube and who inspired you to do YouTube from Furman Pasquel? Um, I think I started YouTube during my super late Town Hall 7, um, Town Hall 7 time, or my, or really early my Town Hall 8 stage, and who inspired you to do YouTube? It was Daddy, he was the YouTuber I used to watch a lot, um, and that is the question, so hopefully you guys did enjoy this question, um, uh, thank you for so many questions you, uh, dropped down in the Q&A video, hopefully I answered your questions. Uh, questions thoroughly and uh, you know as my best of ability as I can but anyway hopefully you guys did enjoy this video make sure to leave a like comment and subscribe and as always I'll see you all on my next video and if we could smash 60 likes that would be awesome